Firstly, before we start this video, I want to say a thank you to all my 100 subscribers, man. This is the only motivation I get from YouTube for now, so thank you all. I really appreciate it. How's it going, guys? Max here. So, new leaks for the upcoming Galaxy Z Flip 3 has just been released. Let's get into it. We recently saw photos from Tom, I think it's via Let's Go Digital, where he showed the upcoming Galaxy Z Flip 3. And, um, okay, it's just a picture. But we see something like a notification um, bar, not just a bar, like a screen. This is the kind of screen that usually um, appears on phones when you put them on the always on display. So we see it there and um, for me, I think it's useless at this point. I'm not really sure. I don't know what it is for now, but it doesn't look that much useful for now. And um, the device, we didn't really get any color confirmation or anything about the specs. We just got these pictures and um, on leaks actually said, yes, that this can actually be the um, upcoming Z Flip 3, which if it's um, so, I don't really think there, will, there are more changes that's for the phone actually. If you're loving this video, a sub to the channel would be marvelous. And again, we do have confirmation that Samsung's Exynos chipsets are partnering with AMD. This is mind blowing. For the upcoming Exynos chipsets, we knew about that before, but Ice Universe just gave us a little bit of hint saying that we might not actually need to wait till next year or so to actually see AMD integrated Exynos chipsets. And if this is actually true, and if AMD helped to fine tune or integrate the Exynos 2100 in any single way, man, this chipset is going to be mind blowing and out of control. We've also already seen the benchmarks and seen that it's um, actually exceeding 4,000 points on multi core which is actually great and as Ice Universe said that um, Samsung will soon use Exynos chipsets for every single market, no more Snapdragon or Exynos, they will soon be using Exynos chipsets on every single market which actually sounds smart at this point since their Exynos chipsets are going to surpass Snapdragon massively so this sounds like something to do. Well of course give me your thoughts about this in the comment section, subscribe and I'll see you next time, see ya.